in today's video, I'm going to be showing you the best PDSW528 in Modern Warfare 2. We dropped two gameplays with this gun today. The class self is at the end, as always. Comment 30 likes on today's video and make sure to put Noti Gang in the comments for a chance to be in the next video. Let's get straight into it. Chat, we've drawn a bit late, but let's go. Wow, it actually kills really quick, you know, chap. Wow. Wow. Wrong lobby, boys. Wow. Five kills, first game on. Wow. Wow, bro. Bro, what is going on? Wow. Enemy is taking
another 75 kill game. So as you can tell right there, the class setup worked really well with the PDSW528. The X13 Auto Handgun I use with all my guns now. Um, stun grenades, throwing knives, and a perk package one. We also have dead silence on. You can choose to change some of these things if you want to. If you're playing games like Hardpoint or Domination, you could go for trophy systems or munition boxes. However, I'll go for dead silence. Getting onto the perk package one now. We have double time, strong arm, fast hands, and high alert. You can switch some of these things around if you do prefer. You could put ghost on for high alert. That is completely up to you. However, getting onto the X13 Auto right now, as you can see with the XRK side window six slide barrel the fjx diode 70 laser corona mini dot you can choose to switch that about if you don't want that optic the f tack OZ grip rear grip and the 50 round drum mag now we don't use any tuning on any of these attachments so don't put any on now getting onto the main weapon itself the pdsw so the first attachment is ammunition we went for the 5.7 x 28 mm over pressured plus p that was a very long word but that is going to be your first attachment. You tune for this is recoil smoothness all the way to the left and minus 0.87 towards recoil steadiness. Your second attachment right now, we've got a rear grip, which is a stick 40 grip. This is just going to increase your recoil control in general. Very important to have on. You tune for this is aim blood sight speed all the way and sprint fire speed all the way. For your third attachment now, we're going for a stock, which is the CQB stock. You tune for this is minus 4 towards aim blood sight speed and minus 1.63 towards aim walking speed. Now onto the fourth attachment. I use this with a lot of my SMG. You've got the VLK Laser 7MW. Once again, this is going to increase your ADS speed. Very important to have on. Your tuning for this is going to be sprint fire speed all the way and minus 31.26 towards the aim down sight speed. Now, finally, last attachment we are going for the Bruin Pendulum Muzzle. This is going to increase recoil control once again. Your tuning for this is minus 0.65 towards the aim down sight speed and plus 25 towards recoil control. So that was the whole class setup. Hope you did enjoy it. I do post two times a day at the minute one at midday and one at 6 pm BS. Tea, so make sure to stay tuned for them we normally post a modern warfare 2 gameplay about 12 and then also a warzone 2 gameplay at 6 p.m we also stream on twitch like every other day so make sure to come through the link for that will be down below in the description and make sure to subscribe like and comment if you did enjoy i do appreciate you watching take it easy have a great day and peace